The following contest is an Extreme Rules match, and it is for the United States Championship. Introducing the challenger, from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, the game, Triple H. Here's a man who's no stranger to marquee matchups, the King of Kings, Triple H. Well, you got that right, Cole. The game's fought them all. Undertaker, Cena, Flair, Stone Cold, and the list goes on and on. It's not every day you see a United States Championship match of this caliber. I cannot even wait for this one to get started. Introducing the challenger from Victoria, Texas. Weighing in at 252 pounds, he is the WWE Yokes Heavyweight Champion, Stone Cold Steve Austin. You know, sometimes a superstar just has that look in his eye. And this is one of those times. If this one doesn't end up on a highlight reel somewhere, I'll be incredibly surprised. And their opponent, from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 245 pounds, he is the United States Champion, the Apex Predator, Randy Orton. Wow, this arena has come completely unglued. Three of WWE's most polarizing figures set to square off here in this triple threat match. So much anticipation. This is going to be one for the record books. King, we often discuss that strategy is so important in a triple threat match. To emerge victorious, a superstar must be able to seize opportunity. That could include letting the opponent do all the work in beating down the other participant and then coming in to reap the benefits. Checking out Triple H. What can you tell us right now? I know he's excited about this United States Championship opportunity and all the history that comes with it. You like to talk about all the great Hall of Famers that have held that title, Michael, and I know he'd like his name added to that list. What's he going to do here? What's he going to do here? Well, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. 
dishing out some serious punishment here. You know, they say a carpenter's only as good as his tools. Well, there's no one better utilizing all his tools to defeat an opponent than Triple H. I mean, the Harley Race high knee, the Arn Anderson spine buster, and the pedigree. They're all awesome. how slow he is to react right now. And there's another smack. I don't think there's any lengths that these superstars won't go to to achieve victory here tonight. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Steve Austin. King, you talked before about a carpenter using his tools. The game is so adept at picking an opponent apart piece by piece until that opponent is rendered defenseless. The consummate combatant, Triple H indeed, has many weapons to choose from. So damaging. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. There's no coming back from that. Wow, he's still down after that. This might be it. Astonishing maneuver by Randy Orton. Wow, he's still down after that. Just trying to goad his opponent into making a mistake here. When you discuss all the moves that are at Triple H's disposal, it illustrates almost instantly why he's the cerebral assassin. Something to also remember, where you see Triple H, you know his equalizer, the sledgehammer, is not far behind. Well, Michael, it's tough not to talk about all of Triple H's weapons. When you bring the sledgehammer into it, it makes the game that much more intimidating and lethal. Quick thinking to avoid that. You have to think that's it. Whoa, when you get, nobody comes back from this. Triple H is so dangerous. When the game creates that energy for himself and begins to control the match, he's like a rabid dog who will not stop his attack. What a powerful slam! Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost... Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick. Boy, he is really tired now. Well, that steel chair has done the damage. How much damage did that do? A lot, from the looks of it. Back where it belongs, inside the ring. Not today, too fast. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Steve Austin. Oh, out of nowhere. Orton trapped him. Slot. Orton's just vicious. It only takes a couple of those to bring his night to an end. Triple H, what a maneuver. Here's the cut. And the shoulder's up. And the match continues. I love this. I have no idea. I have no idea how Randy Orton kicked out of that. Count's broken. My God, somehow he broke the referee's count. What a battle. Oh, man. Just when you think this is over, the war wages on. No way. What a move from Randy Orton. That's how you impress the WWE Universe, folks. Quick thinking to avoid that. When this guy's on, look out. Oh, this spells Luthez Press. Man, that did Luthez proud. Look at this. And he breaks the three count. Oh, I got to tell you, I really thought that. And he escapes with a kick out. You know, it's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in his tank. Oh, wait, nice reversal. And there's the scoop. Here he goes for the win. Let's do this. Wow, there's the save. The match continues. Nice reversal by Orton. Yeah, that's because he saw that one coming a mile away. Showing an aggressive side here. Oh, gosh. Hey, what do you want for your last meal? Boy, 
he just got laid out. Not today, too fast. Austin, no! A perfect Stone Cold Stunner! Could this be it? I think so. the only way to describe this match. Oh, they threw everything they had at each other in this match. I can't believe what we just saw. Highlight after highlight. And here's some highlights from the matchup. the job done here tonight. Nothing for Steve Austin to be ashamed of. That was some stiff competition here tonight. With that win in the books, we must now move on.